hey y'all welcome back to my youtube channel so i figured i'd hop on here real quick and do like a small ulta unboxing um i figured i'd try and see how like unboxing videos do on my channel just so i know whether i should incorporate them in the future if i order things from ulta or sephora or anything like that or if i should just you know do those off camera and then do the review on the products later like I usually do so yeah I guess we will get into this little tiny unboxing I ordered like five things from Ulta um, like two weeks ago and I finally got everything last week my friend in California it's Cell she um, sent me a $40 Ulta gift card for my birthday so I just bought all these things with her gift card, so thank you, it's so, I loved it, and I can't wait to try these things. So I already opened the box off the of camera, just because I was a little too excited that I finally got my stuff, but I'll show you what's what came in the box. So the first thing I got was the Voluminous Lash Paradise by L'Oreal. This is in the blackest black, and it's their waterproof one. I love and I mean love my better than six Too Faced mascara and I've heard this is a good dupe for it so I figured I would buy it and see if it's a dupe or if it's just a little bit similar and it works just as well so I'm gonna have to try this out and we'll see and then the next four things that I got are all from the same brand and this brand has been floating around like TikTok, Instagram, things like that. And I've heard a lot of good things, so I figured I would give it a try. And it's super cheap. So this was, I think, $8 at Ulta. And then I got some stuff from The Ordinary brand. So one of the first things I got was this lactic acid 10% plus HA serum. It's a high strength lactic acid super facial peeling formulation. Um, so I got this. I read that this was really good for uneven skin tones, texture irregularities, and fine lines. And I actually have some texture irregularities like right here on my cheek and a little bit on my forehead. And I never get them to go away no matter like how many skincare things I try. So I figured I'd try it. And it just looks like this. It comes in a cute little glass bottle. And if you unscrew the top and squeeze the top, it has the little, um, whatchamacallit, dropper thingy. So I thought that was super cool. And it smells, probably shouldn't smell like that, but. It smells pretty good. Kind of reminds me of the way acetone smells, but if it works, I'll get over the smell. So I'm super excited to try that. This one I think was nine or eight dollars. So super happy with that. Next, I got the caffeine solution 5% plus EGCG. So this reduces the appearance of eye contour, pigmentation, and puffiness. So let's open this bad boy up. I got this mostly because I, my eyes are really puffy. And they do get pretty, like, crinkly, I guess, like right here. And this, I've heard that this will help correct it. So we're going to try it. Just comes like this. Um, it's a weird, it's not liquid. And it, well, actually, it is liquid. It's just really thick here. Let me show it to you. So it's like this. Excuse me, I just burped. That's so disgusting. I'm so sorry. But I probably won't edit that out. But anyways, it comes like this. Yeah, it's super thick. It smells. Doesn't have a smell. Okay, that one doesn't have a smell. But it looks pretty good. I'm excited to try this out. I'll probably try them out over the next couple of weeks and you'll expect to see a video on each thing separately once I'm done trying it out, seeing if my skin likes it and things like that. So this one 
I'm super excited for because this is what I've seen most on TikTok probably and on Instagram. It's their AHA 30% plus BHA 2% peeling solution. It's a 10 minute exfoliating facial with a pH of 3.6. Um, let's see, this one doesn't say what it targets like the other ones do. Hmm. Well, we'll see. So this is what everyone's been seeing and I think you guys know what it is. It's this pretty thing. It's their red facial peeling mask. It looks like this. It looks, yeah, it looks like the color of blood like everybody says it does. And I can't wait to try this out. I've heard that this stings really, really bad. So I'll probably test it out on a patch of my, my arm or the back of my hand before I put this on my face. But I've heard it's really good with helping with acne scars, blemishes, and things like that. And as we talk about blemishes, I have one like right here on my cheek that I've been trying to get rid of for the past two days. And she does not want to go away. But that's okay. And then the next thing I have is... I'm going to butcher this word, y'all. The Aziliac Acid Suspension 10%. It's a multifunctional brightening formula. I think this is a lotion. I can't remember. Um, this one targets uneven tone, dullness, and texture irregularities. So like I said earlier, I want to get rid of those textures that are on my cheeks and my forehead. And this was oddly the most expensive. Everything else... Sorry, I didn't mention the prices. Everything that I've shown, the, these, these, these three things in my hand were each like eight or nine dollars a piece. This one was a little more expensive. This one was, I think, I wanna say it was like 12 or 14 dollars. But I'll have the link to everything in the description down below in case I'm wrong or some, or they're on sale, who knows? But they're already so cheap, so. I don't think these will ever go on sale. But this is what it looks like. Yep, it's just like a little lotion. It says apply to face AM and in PM to improve to improve visible brightness and the appearance of skin texture. So it's a little lotion. It's sealed. I haven't even taken the little cap off, so let's see if it has a smell. Yep, it's got a smell. It smells like any regular lotion, kind of smells like the Cetaphil lotion. And I put the cap on wrong and that's going to bug me. There it goes. So yeah, that is this little guy. I'm very excited to try these things. I don't know what I'm more excited to try, the mascara or that red facial peel I showed you guys. Because they all look pretty darn cool. And each of these little serums or peels or whatever they are one fluid ounce so you can take them traveling if you want to and then this is also one fluid ounce in the lotion form so yeah I will test all of these wonderful little products out for you guys and do some videos and we'll see how they work out for my skin Hopefully they don't get rid of these freckles because I have tried things that got rid of these freckles and I was not very happy. I kind of like my freckles. So yeah, um, I guess stay tuned for the following weeks to see the videos on all these products and how I feel about them. Thanks you guys for watching this video. Please like and comment below and subscribe to my channel. I'll see y'all later. Bye!